I'm excited. Almost a basement. <laughs> to, to like a really nice hotel in this lovely like venue. So we're up in a game. You know what I mean? We're up in a game. It's happening. Um, yeah, very, very exciting day ahead. So we have loads of stuff planned. And um, the big thing about today is like talk to us. This isn't like a normal creator event where you just get a selfie, even though I love getting selfies with Sylvia. So, yeah. um, you can have a chat to us, there's plenty of time to like, you know, have fun, be part of vlogs, ask questions, the whole shebang. Uh, we just love to have you guys here. Yeah. So like all the creators are going to be pretty much in this room at all times, so like feel free to chat to them like whenever whenever you want, you know. Like the, we're just going to be mingling the entire day. So as Thomas said, ask questions, talk to us, we are human. <laughs> um, after hearing the discussions in the crowd, my best bet is probably Nevi again. I would say that's probably what I'm going to go with. Like Nevi spends a lot of time at discos, so not enough time to Snapchat. Tom's <laughs> doing psychology or something. <laughs> Keen's trying to learn how to dance on TikTok and Tala. And Mikey. Uh, no, no, it's not Mikey, so it's <laughs> So, being short. What, what's the final answer in Team YouTube? He's not up to anything. I think he's either Neve or Lauren. Neve, yeah. No, but Neve's on our team. It's you. It's Lauren. Team Tim Tox. We're going to Neve. Okay. The answer is. Yes! Just over one minute by arm. That means you guys are tied. At the end of the round, we are now moving on to round two. Your general social media knowledge of different things that have happened over the internet, possibly recently, but also we might delve into the past on the internet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be showing up a couple of pictures. We've got this picture, all right? What I need everyone to do is to explain what's going on in this picture. Try to tell me what this picture relates to in social media. That's how Kyle gets his eyebrows in the morning. Melted Starburst. <laughs> Look at those keen putting on the makeup this morning. <laughs> Just about gloss. As if that's even a thing. You think? Well, it's definitely Jeffree's star, anyways, because there's a star in the thing. Is it like flavored? Or like, what's the story there? I mean, you can make it if you want, but like, I wouldn't dust. recommend it. So, who's, who's Jeffree Star now? Jeffree Star is a. Um, it's like a pop makeup artist. <laughs> Like Tom. He's a bit out there. <laughs> it's just Tom is doing makeup actually. Well, why is there flavors? So we're not What? I feel like your music is like it's like chocolate and vanilla. Nice Tom. Does that does anybody have that palette? Does that, anyone anyone in the crowd knows what is it? What is it? Or is it just, is it just, just makeup? It's so not chew, it's not servers. You can eat it. Okay. So, Team TikTok, what's going on in the situation? Your Lauren seems to know the most. I'm only copying Amy Nelson. <laughs> it's the Shane Dawson on Jeffree Star Ooh. Okay. Um, despite popular belief, me and Kyle do not wear makeup, so I'm going to pass the mic over to you. Someone who would know a bit about it, so. <laughs> I actually don't have this poll, but um, I watched a documentary on it and I think. I'm not fully sure, but I think it's like to someone who doesn't know how to do makeup, like done palette with someone professional, and uh, put his favorite things into the palette. Do you know what the name of the palette is? Conspiracy theory palette? Uh, I think I already said that. T TikTok, what's the name of the palette? Conspiracy. Theory. Can you say conspiracy theory? All right, and the answer is the conspiracy palette. <laughs> I'm giving it to these guys. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, this was um, some makeup palette that Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star, two absolute massive social media mega stars, made together, and then this massive like docu series on the entire on the entire process. And although I'm not into makeup at all, for some reason I watched it. And you know, so, and then and then I bought it and just started doing it every day. <laughs> but yeah, so you that is you can do a bit of bush there. That is, uh, that is uh, a point to you. Team TikTok, go go. Right. Can anyone explain what's going on this, in this picture? Who sure. recognizes right, this picture? That's Stella's hair. <laughs> Team TikTok. 
It looks like some form of ice cream. Yeah, you only sign you made your son play a song or something. So. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Does anyone want to sing it if they know it? Girl, you got any other? <laughs> <laughs> we have Justin Bieber's in front of us. This is Tim Tom, everybody. Here's the rendition of Johnny. Team YouTube, what's your final answer? What's up? What is it going on in this video? Eat. Yeah, I think it's the music video. I haven't seen it though. I did, I did watch the Caribbean Karaoke video last night with James Gordon and Justin Bieber. And maybe it's the music video? That's my best guess. I don't know. I'm afraid. We're gonna go with the music video of Justin Bieber. Music video. You're afraid. Huh? You're afraid? I know. I'm very, I'm trembling here. Okay, so hopefully it's the right answer. We're trailing here. <laughs> <laughs> Team TikTok. Final answer. Looks like you made a hair gel out of a person's head in the morning. <laughs> I think it's the lyric video for uh, the Justin Bieber song, you know me? I think you've seen this, it's like a continuous ice cream that just like rotates, it's so nice to watch. So much. Yeah, it's amazing. Nice to meet you. Yes, so this is uh, Justin Bieber's uh, yummy video that he released like two weeks ago or something like that. And it absolutely broke the internet, as anything he seems to do. So that is going to to TikTok again. What? Yeah. Uh, wait, what's uh, the same thing before? Oh, uh, uh, you said the lyric video. He, he said the lyric video, yeah, but, uh, which apparently is because it says lyric video. But uh, <laughs> and I mean, that's that's a drop. Team TikTok, you're still one point ahead. I am absolutely obsessed with PewDiePie, so this oh, yeah? is when uh, PewDiePie and T Series are battling out for the biggest. Uh, YouTube channel. Up to 100 million. Five <laughs> uh, points. That's become to 100 million. So, no, that has to be done to 100 million subs. <laughs> PewDiePie and T Series go head and head to each other to 100 million subs. I already said that. Point to us. Now you said full name. Yeah. Now you didn't. PewDiePie has like 100 million subs. I already said it. No, you already said it. <laughs> point to YouTube. <laughs> PewDiePie and T Series were in a race to reach 100 million subscribers. It's not Kyle Arnold in 20 years. <laughs> it's Keen Larn in the TikTok lab. <laughs> yeah. We all know that guy isn't sex. It's definitely. Oh, there he is. Logan. He was meant to come to Potter Did you see that? Yeah, he can't yeah. say. Um, Jake Paul. And then we have. Is, is that. Is that. Tana? Yeah. Tana That's the priest cow. Tana Woodrow. Yeah, so it's a journey. Jake Paul and Tanamundi got married. It's a fake marriage. It's not a real marriage. It wasn't legal. Isn't Logan Paul dating her now or something? Do you hear about that? What story is that? No, Logan and Tan are like dating. No. Yeah, he made a video about it. It was just him. They went out and took pictures together so the press would get it. So Jake and Tan are together? No, they split. That's fake too. Is she not bisexual now or something as well? Is she not with Bella? Bella, Bella, Bella. <laughs> <laughs> Jay Paul and Tana's wife video. Thank you. Darryl, we said that before then. We said that before then. I'm sorry. Come on, come on. Oh, so this is the end of the zoo. Finn. But anyways, uh, Jay Paul and Tana Mojio. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, uh, apparently they got married and they're two massive social media stars. But it was fake. Uh, in fairness, Team YouTube said it first. That's the point to Team YouTube. That means Team YouTube are one point ahead. Exactly. Yeah. Woo! That should have been no. fact checking. What is it? Fact checking. Fact checking. Fact checking. Fact checking. Look at Tom's stomach. <laughs> Let me tell you. Look at the Now we're trying to find parking in this event. Yeah. <laughs> That's Cal giving me a Lambo in the future of Mojo. <laughs> <laughs> that was Dara and me at Christmas time. <laughs> you got your car? I literally just realized that I did not pay for parking. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no. This is a terrible day for boys. Uh, anyways, <laughs> it's, uh, it's surprising his best friend for his birthday with her. Oh, Heat. Surprise his friend Heat. With a Ferrari. Okay, cool. Surprise his friend Heat. How's that? With a Ferrari. It's a Lamborghini. Oh, a Lamborghini. It was not a Ferrari. Like, we all like GTA. I gave the answer first there. Team YouTube, we have got another point. Yeah.
I know a lot of music they do doing. Well done to Team YouTube! Woo! On Team TikTok, get the hell off stage, you losers! You haven't found some boys yet, get off the stage. Why do you watch your step when you get off? I don't know. As a ladder, as a ladder. Alright, that is the end of TikTokers versus YouTubers. Well done to Team YouTube. Now what we're going to move into is a nice fireside chat with a few of the lads. And that's going to be Cal Arnold, Sean Tracy, and Ryan Warren. So everyone else can get cut off stage. Thank you. <laughs> Fresh fade, right? Fresh, fresh fade. Fade. It's clean, isn't it? Fresh fade and a fresh face on the scene of social media. Ryan recently has blown up on Instagram in the last couple of months. He has gained 12,000 followers in two seconds. <laughs> that quick, it was that quick. Um, Ryan, do you want to tell us what, what you do or introduce yourself? Um, yeah, well, I'm Ryan. I'm 20 and I do um, Instagram skits. Well, now we used to do TikTok as well, but we started out on Instagram and YouTube. And they're just kind of like, well, we're forming the skits, but I play every character in them. And basically, I basically talk to myself in my room. That's what I do. <laughs> That's a short version of it. And people seem to like it, so it's, it's gone somewhere. It's short, or, not as short as mine, but yeah, it's pretty short. <laughs> it's pretty short. Close. Mr. Kyle Arnold. Man, who, who are you? Who are you? He's recording here for his vlog as well. Yeah. Uh, well, my name is Cal Arnold, and uh, I'm a YouTuber, actor, person. Um, yeah, so I've been making videos like since I was like eight, and then I only like met these like two years ago. But yeah, basically, I upload videos of me and the lads just messing about, having a laugh, and uh, yeah, it just kind of took off. I uh, just started to try and Irish in the title, and the things started to work out. So yeah, John Tracy. Right, watch my obnoxiously loud voice blow the speakers in this room. Um, okay, so I like to think I'm just a filmmaker who's also in school at the moment. I make, I'm making promotional videos at the moment, YouTube videos, uh, videos for, where's it going with that one? Oh yeah, <laughs> sorry, short films and also documentaries. So uh, currently I'm just constantly working on YouTube videos kind of, but I'm also uh, editing my new documentary, More Than Just a Game. It's a rugby documentary which I filmed in December and really, really excited about that one. It just feels like something really fresh for me creatively. And then I also just finished my new short film, Broken Reflection. Um, and that's really exciting. That's going to film festivals hopefully soon enough. And uh, that's kind of my life, yeah. Hey, it's Ryan. What, um, like what got you started when it came to sort of Instagram skits? And obviously, I'm sure anybody here could relate. If you've ever tried to make content online, it can be quite scary because you're afraid of your friends judging you. And um, how did you make that leap to actually start making stuff? Yeah, so I'm like different to like Carl and Sean because they started when they were young. I only started when I was 18, which is only two years ago. I got my first camera and tried to get used to it. The skits came along. I was um, filming a YouTube video where I make 100 TikToks in one day, and it was supposed to be just a joke and just a mess, and it was the whole 100. Team videos that time was like, oh, I make 100 TikToks. I made two in one day, I was exhausted. And I just sent them to my friends, and they were like, Well, just put that on Instagram because you don't post on Instagram. I never posted on Instagram, even when it came to pictures. And people loved it. It got more likes than all my Instagram stuff. So I was like, People ask for more. And they were easier to make, so I just kept making them. And then I got more into it, and I did like camera angles and stuff, and just made them more crazier. And, that's it. Seven or eight, a Tesco one, and I was just blown away by the set. I loved every aspect of it, wanted it to be my life, undoubtedly. And I remember at the time watching so much Film Riot uh, on the YouTube channel. Uh, they just make those YouTube videos about filmmaking, basically. My dad had a bunch of cameras because my granddad was a photographer, uh, and so all that kind of was just like so magical for me. And then I was actually the same as Cal, I had a Nintendo 3DS and I started making uh, Lego TikToks. I literally said TikToks for TikToks. I was going to say TikTok there, I have no idea why. Uh, I made Lego videos and stop motion. Uh, there was this YouTuber called Michael Hickox Films who's still making videos. Yeah, yeah, he watches them as well. Yeah, absolutely nerded out there for a second. <laughs> and uh, I watched all those videos and I just loved it. So I made stop motion videos and then, like, 
I, 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 I loved cameras and I also started to really love watching YouTube videos. I mean, at first it was just Minecraft, Dan, TDM kind of stuff. And then I saw Casey Neistat and stuff and I really loved that side of things. Um, so I started summer of 2016 going into first year, which is a very scary time to start, to start a YouTube channel. But it was kind of just like just before puberty sort of where I was like, I don't really care. Like, I'm just doing it because I want to. And I think I was very lucky then because it just kind of carried on throughout first year um, and there was like a few like self doubts in first year and then but I was also very like I think as Cal said fortunate in the sense I mean I kind of I did kind of I didn't care what people thought it was more that I think everyone cares what people think but it never really like got me down it was more like haters and my motivators sort of thing but like if it, I would get kind of bothered by it if I was out in public or like at a as we were talking about like discos and stuff like that and people would be laughing at me for it sort of thing that was difficult but then was like, Navy laughing at No, I never sure. saw Navy at a disco, but um, uh, yeah, Daniel Wicklow. Yes, yeah, Daniel Wicklow yeah, was just like all the like, culties. And, um, <laughs> and yeah, that would kind of bother me, but I just kind of continued on. And as soon as I started to make, like, improve with my videos and um, get more confidence from it just by making more and more stuff, that like really, that people kind of gain more respect for it and that all goes out the window. And it's worth it in the end. I looked so tired. <laughs> yeah. We were drive, driving home from Blogger Comp and we were like, I was just like, oh my gosh, should we get donuts. So we're in the Krispy Kreme drive thru now and I'm getting a big fat coffee and maybe a glazed donut. I kind of want one. Mm -hmm. So I'm excited. I think that's all I have to say now. <laughs> I was too scared to vlog at it. Oh, boo. But you'll see some clips. God, I'm very red. I, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck the window. <laughs> Oh my god, get me over here. Come here, get I got all my fucking thing. Where's the fucking key? Oh, there we go. 
Perfect, thank you. Bye. Oh my god, did he get quick? <laughs> get out of here. Oh. The window. <laughs> she saw what? She saw everything. The window's open. <laughs> oh, fuck my life. <laughs> Oh, that was so embarrassing. Oh, oh this is fucking funny though. <laughs> <laughs> the car comes out. <laughs> oh. Oh. <Jesus. laughs> the first time I was like, is she alright? Jesus. <laughs> 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 God, calm down. <laughs> oh, I think I need to pull in for a second. <laughs> I don't eat my donut. <laughs> oh. Fucking hell. They can go around. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Stop 